Yo, pal mates. All right, we're here at the Dex scan. I just arrived. Um, found a neat little parking spot right outside the uh, 306 there. Um, traffic was a bitch. Oh my god, cops everywhere. Um, I still lane splitted and whatever, but goddamn. And um, the whole way, traffic lane split the whole way, all the way here, just to make it in time for this appointment. Anyway, it's going to be interesting to see the results, and uh, I'll share it all with you guys in, in, in the next part. Uh, so yeah, and we'll do a comparison analysis and stuff like that on where we're at um, previously on getting the DEXA scan. And um, this, will, this will determine how much I've got to cut and how long it's going to take me. So uh, this is going to be interesting. Alright guys, see you soon. As you can see, they encourage weight loss products like Berry Delicious Smoothie, whatever the fuck that is. <laughs> they even have all the healthy meals and shit that they give people. <laughs> epic, apparently healthy. <laughs> it's pretty epic this place, honestly. No socks. No socks. No socks. Oh, you're taking pictures. No, I, I do a little recording on YouTube. <laughs> I, I track my progress. You track everything. I track everything. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's see what we weigh here. All right. All right, Don't get off it. Don't get off. Gain some, I think. <laughs> Gain some fat. <laughs> <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> That's alright. No, I will. I, have, I would have for sure. <laughs> I know I have. That'd be funny. You think you have? Oh, yeah. Guaranteed. I know you have because I had 161 here. Yeah. Ooh. 161 last time? Yes. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Alright, guys. Just got done doing the DEXA scan. Um, you, have to put, you have to actually put your toes together like this during the scan for six minutes. And whilst it sounds easy, it actually is quite difficult if you're naturally used to squatting like that. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> now we're gonna see the results. Now you're gonna see the results. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's All right. have a look. So. so here is. Let me see how close it is to this. Is it 14.9? 14.9, yeah. It's pretty much what I predicted 15, so. Is it? This thing's pretty close. This is the little the yeah. scale that you got on. Oh, okay, yeah. So nice. it uses bioimpedance, which is a different method to get the um, okay. the body fat measurement. I think, oh, I think yeah. the Dexa gave me 14.5, 14.9, yeah. it's 14. Point, that's pretty close. Pretty close. So um, let's see your, your comparison. Yeah, your body fat's great. So did you do you understand these the numbers here? Yeah, yeah. Already? So I, I just wanted to comparison in terms of um, okay. So where you muscle. were last time compared yeah. to now? And, mm. All right. So these are your numbers for today. Yeah. All these here are your new ones. Okay. The ones that you'll see here are the comparison of where it was. Ah, okay. Okay. So this is the date of where it was. This is yeah. where it is right now. Okay. So definitely put on some lean muscle. Lean yeah. Mass there. Okay. Yeah, cool. Exactly. All right. Cool. Also added some fat mass, of course. <laughs> yeah. That's all right. Yeah, that's no okay. Worries. Okay, cool. So yeah, so this is the number here that only the DEXA can give you. Yep. Okay, so this is the only only way that you can get this actual number. Mm -hmm. And this is the number that's on here. Here. Right, okay. Okay, this is the only way you can get it is from a DEXA scan. Mm -hmm. And what that measures, that's that measurement is specific to you. Okay, so there's no comparison to where you're gonna use this. This is this doesn't indicate any. It's there's no number for you to compare this to of anybody else. There's no like norms. Sure, sure. Okay, but this is the number that you want to keep going up. Okay. Okay, and this is what exactly what you did. You increased your muscle mass. You increased a little fat on the way, but but you yeah. increase your muscle mass, sure, which sure. is that's what we want to do. Okay. Okay. So yeah, we want this to keep going down, but you're low right now. Yeah. Okay. Good job. Well, from this point forward, it'll be like. Dropping back that back right. down now. And keep it without like getting any of your muscle out. Right. Yeah. That's the goal now. <laughs> cardio will do that. Keep the strength. If you want to do cardio. And dropping some food. Yeah. Watch your food a little bit. <laughs> All right. So these are yours. Right. I keep this one. Okay. Okay. This is yours. It'll show you where your, um, where your fat increased. Do you see it here? Yeah. Okay. Cool. 
So where is it? Put Did on, you see where it put on here? A little bit the on the orange part. Ah, uh, okay. You see what it looks like yeah, a little different yeah. here? Yeah. Okay. That's right where it went. Right on the hips. Okay, interesting. Yeah. Yeah. Dominal so you should be able there. to see it yeah. on. Where's my compartmentalized? Do they have any comparison? Your bone mineral density identical. No change. It shouldn't change because it's it hasn't been that long. Yeah. It takes years for that stuff no, to change. No, not well. much. No? Not much. We see it in a um, in a person who diets. Diets. So we'll have like, let's say you put yourself on like this super, super strict diet. And what it'll do is it'll leach some of the minerals from your bones. So we'll see the density of your bones go down. Right. So how? what about increasing of density of... That takes a little while for it to, right. to go up. But if you lift weights, it will go up. Yeah. You know what we see here, which is actually a, a, a strange phenomenon? We see here a lot of times like when I can tell if you are heavy as a child. Okay. Because your bone mineral density will be really high. Right. Because you carried around a lot of weight when your body was built, when your bones were forming. Yeah. In their formative years, you carry a lot of weight on them. Oh, it's basically like a bodybuilder as a kid. Right. And so it forces your body to have bigger density. Exactly. Bone. Okay. The bones become really dense. So you'll notice like I'll see somebody and I'll ask them like, were you heavy as a kid? And they're like, yeah, how do you know? I mean, there's yeah. somebody that's in great shape right. and they're like, yeah, I was a heavy kid until I was like a teenager. Right. And, and this will be really, it'll be up all the way up here. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Hmm. All right. So that's it. These are the same numbers that you, that you had before. You don't need me to go over any of these, do you? Nah, no, nah, that's okay. all right. And this is, these are the, the numbers that show you where you are percentile-wise. Okay. So there's only 3% of people at your age that have lower body fat than you. Oh, okay, right. Which is... It's okay. That's great. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> all right, well... That's a young normal and that's age matched. 2% at your age. Okay. And a young person. Nice. All right, but it's great. All right. All right, guys, as you can see, that was the results of the DEXA scan. Pretty interesting, actually. Um, so we put on a little bit of muscle, muscle mass. Um, obviously, put on some body fat as well. So now we're going to spend some time um, cutting down the body fat, keeping the muscle mass. And, you know, it's going to be interesting because I'm going to get another DEXA scan in like three months. And I'm going to see if, I know, it's, I know all the science points to the fact that you can't build muscle while you're cutting, right? Now I know that that's some that's you know everyone says that, but I want to. I still got to give it a shot, nonetheless. I'm still going to try. Okay, it's going to be interesting to see if there's more muscle mass, and ooh, Dexter will reveal it. Dexter will reveal it if there's more muscle mass in three months' time while it's dieting down. So anyway, guys, that's it. Um, I'm gonna put a link just here. I uh, should see on the screen about there. <laughs> Of how much body fat I'm going to lose, I'm going to cut um, based on the percentage that we've got the reading result, which was 14.5% body fat. Um, so I want to show you how to calculate that in the description box. So make sure you check that out. Anyway, guys, like, comment, subscribe to my videos. You know the deal, and uh, I'll see you in the next video. Ciao.